She deserves it. It is not her fault that she has a huge crush on me. Hannah's been making the moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, Em. Just because he's class prez doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, Em, I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. weekend. Josh. Jeez, Josh. <laughs> Once again, brother, you've outdone us oh. all. God, what did our naive sister get herself into now? I got your note. I'm glad you can make it. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. going it's fine she just can't take a joke it was just a prank han what did you do we just messing around beth it wasn't serious you jerks hannah hannah so should we go after her you know i kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now mike
Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? All right. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It, it is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Oh, that's good. In what way did it make you happy? Sunshine. <laughs> I see. So which word would best describe how you feel about darkness? Afraid, really. That's interesting. Where I come from, way up north in Sweden, the nights are 18 hours long. <laughs> and why do you think you're afraid of the dark? Well, it's a perfectly natural fear. Darkness, after all, is the unseen and therefore 
the unknown. And what could inspire fear more than the terror of uncertainty? Oh dear. We seem to be out of time for this session. We'll talk again soon. Until then, I suggest you try to stay away from dark places. Today is the one-year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. Listeners, there's an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Thank you for joining us, Andy. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this. And that, uh, I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together. And I'm thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and, um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters and, you know. Okay, so let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? Yes!
Bella? You hungry? Huh? Ah, damn it. Hey, hey, hey. It's okay. That's it. Come on. <laughs> Cutie. <laughs> cool. all the way up here. Sam, hey, you made it. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. Going to blow your mind. comes to mind why is this even here what do you mean w what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge uh dude have you ever met josh's dad yeah he thinks he's like grizzly adams or something want to try uh no you go ahead grizzly <laughs> all right here goes All right, I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. Nah, I don't think so, girl. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Man, it 
memories. It's definitely weird coming back up here after a whole year. Yeah, I swear, the moment I got here, it... Hey, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked, to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. After you. Oh, real gentleman. What a crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how rich you are. They're not so rich. They only bought a mountain. Huh? I thought the car was closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm trying to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this gonna take? It's a big mountain. You gonna publish? What? Your pretty poem. The Sleeping Giant of the Blackwood Forge. Oh, shut up. Finally, you coming? Yeah, well. I was gonna stay here and catch some Z's, but okay. I'm just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right, adventure begins. Oh, I hope this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I don't know, I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro, good talk. <laughs> you know what, let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Ah, uh, you know what, you're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her training bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another 10 minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. This is all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey! Well, 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 what do we have Chris. here? Chris! My goodness! 
Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Mike and M split were together. Whoa, drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Oh. All right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? I mean, you know, whoever. Uh-huh. Sam? <sighs> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? I don't think it would have been like as pretty. And where's the bellboy when you need one? <sighs> getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, uh, yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. I mean, what do you think? <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. Michael, I'm just gonna lay it out, otherwise this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't wanna make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make out. Uh, no, seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back down the trip. All right. See you, man. See ya. All right. See ya. Oh, crap. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. All right, fine. If it's so important, I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way, but you owe me one. Excuse me? Well, then we're even, at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. See you up there, sweetie. Thank you. Hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. And not in the friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. Oh! oh God. <laughs> oh. Hey, whoa. <sighs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Just you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real scare you. Oh my you. gosh, oh my gosh. Hey, well, 
Man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash, damn. It's okay, it's fine, it's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it... Let me check it out. No. Um, sure, uh, go, go ahead. Knock yourself out, I guess. Oh. Son of a bitch! Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. I... God damn it. Matt. You did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. But who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> Oh! Phrase. <laughs> you pay. You know that? Where are you hiding, little chickadee? Oh! Ah! Hey! hey! Oh, snap! go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. All right, all right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Save some for later, buddy. Endless reserves. <gasps> we should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. scratched the surface in our last session, so let's go a little bit deeper this time. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious.
Did that startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so diligently. <laughs> Spiders, scarecrows, and dogs. <laughs> Some combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> uh, oh, oh. Well, I'm afraid, once again, we're out of time, but I promise. We'll talk again very soon. excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Oh, son of a bitch. So I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh yeah? It feels the same to me. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, I, I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey guys. Get up here okay? Yeah. Well, more or less, but it's so good to see you. What's up with him? Yo, yo, yo. We get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Hey, you doing all right? I, mean, I know it must be really tough without your sister. Stop. I just meant that. No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it. And I just I want us to have a good time, you know? Like we always used to. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's got to be like a window around the corner we can get, like, get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. Hi, Chris. So, how are you doing? Good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. Uh, 
Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? Now I just want to rip that Parker right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Hey, cut it out, man. Yeah, I mean, if you're not gonna bang her, maybe Michael take up the case. Wait, will you back off already? Relax. Just checking to see if there's some blood flowing down there. Yeah. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley, alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Maybe you're right. You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. Jeez. Damn, I'm getting pretty low on juice here. I just gotta turn off my GPS. I'm finally, like, outside, or I might actually use it. Can you cool it on the phone, Tom? What? Why? It's pretty much all you talk about. Well, you know, I mean, I can do all this stuff. Well, you got an app that can get us into the lodge? Got an app that can get you laid? Well, actually, Dude, there's this... you don't. The answer is that you don't. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here, use this. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. Well, what, what is it? Okay, so... I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant gonna help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I gotcha. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye-bye, frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. Hi, Chris. Very funny. 
Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be, like, getting the lock open or something? On it. Freezing our buns off out here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. <laughs> ah, crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It's like a 
bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Sweet home. Sweet is not the word I use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Make yourself at home, bro. We'll do. Yeah. Come on in. Take a load off. Have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway, right? Whoa. It's easy there, cowboy. What the hell were you doing with M out on the trail? What? I saw you and M. At the telescope. Before? We just ran into each other. It's been a while, so we hugged and I said hello. Is that against the law? Right. Yeah. Duh. Sorry, it's been kind of a long day. I overreacted. Nah, man. Don't worry about it. We cool? Yeah, yeah, totally. God, that is so gross. <laughs> Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Yeah. I mean, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like someone's bitter she didn't make the cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. Cuts real deep calling Miss Homecoming a cow. Shut up, Matt. Stay out of it, you dumb oaf. Hey, watch it. Oh, you're the only one who could put him down? No one else can play with your toys? You're such a bitch. Whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0, bitch. Honor roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. <laughs> Are you serious? Do you think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Emily, stop. This is out of hand. Right? There's no reason to fight like this. Yeah, Em. Why are you picking fights over your ex-boyfriend, huh? Stop it! This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. If we can't get along for 10 minutes, and maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah, yeah, all right. You wanna go do that? Any place without that whore. It's right up the trail. <sighs> well, that's over. Yeah. So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the, the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, do I... Do you? I guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm? We can get very warm. Okay. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. <sighs> Exiled. Sexiled. <laughs> Works for me. 
Oh, Barr. How far is this cabin, anyway? This cabin is the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right, and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars. Gonna need these. Porn star? I'd pay to see you. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No. Hot lips, photo booth. All right, read my mind. Okay. Uh, good effort. Next time I get the camera, okay? Well, okay, but. It's not easy holding the thing all like backwards and forwards at the same time. <laughs> okay, let's go. I've got cabin fever. <sighs> Burr, it is freezing out here. Now that's something I can help you with. And how are you gonna do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. Ah, uh, yeah, she's a handful. But maybe ease up on her. She's still kind of torn up from being dumb. Um, hello. Not my problem, Mike, and not yours either. No, I mean, of course not. I'm just saying it's... Like, it's not worth kicking her when she's down. Because I'd much rather spend my time getting down with you. You see, you see what I, I did there? I did that for you. Yeah, okay. But she better stay down is all I'm saying. Nice one, Mikey. Woo! You are a wizard! Sam, the gates shall open. Pretty 
good, right? Yeah, totally. That was just awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hits. <laughs> Psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. Wow. Sleep. I'm Hannah and Beth. I think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm. Getting the creeps now. It's all such a blur. You barely even remember what happened. Well, what I remember is that we played a stupid half baked prank that probably got Hannah and Beth killed. Hey, I mean, it's not our fault they ran into the woods. Yeah. How could anyone have expected them to do a dumb thing like that? I don't think we can get up to the cabin with the path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, a.k.a. Wax- ah! Ah! Jess! Fuck! Hey, Jessica! Yep. Hey. I'm okay. Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Can you get out? I... Uh, I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. All right, coming after you. Just stay put. Hey, handsome. Want to help me move this cart thing? All right. Help me move it. Help me move it. Just grunting together. This is not what I pictured. Not the good kind of willies. Can I offer you a little comfort and reassurance? We'll save it for the cabin. But... This is like historical. Holy bat cave. It's gotta be Native American, right? 
I don't think the miners were getting their arts and crafts on, no. <laughs> no, no, it's like a... <laughs> you alright? Yeah. Close one. I don't think this place is up to code. Yeah, I'm thinking it's time to go. This is a real fixer-upper. When Josh said cabin, I thought like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Uh, I'll take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for the stump. Oh, a telescope. Gonna look at the trees, gonna look at the clouds, gonna look at the cabin. Um, whoa. You all right? I just saw someone at the cabin. Okay, <laughs> let me see. Hey, Jess? Mm hmm? Stay close by, okay? What's up? Uh, this posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. Oh, Michael. I have the best idea. What? Let's go hug a bear. Come on, please. Come on. Let's not hug a bear. <laughs> Answering his mating call. Wow, you're easy. Yeah, got a lot of love to give. <laughs> I'm scared. before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half-empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. <laughs> oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. Ah. Boo! Okay. Okay. Well, that's how it's gonna be.
Come on. All right, Josh, let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. much hmm. hello could this be any more about Mike Those things are a joke, man. They don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time, me and... Well... Hey Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Ooh, yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys, see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um... Okay. Guess so. Brad. You're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. They are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over, you know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric ward before Chris makes a move. <laughs> No, Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... Uh, what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and, you know, that you came, Sam. Josh, we're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all going to make it through this. Together. Um... I want us to have a good time, you know? Hey, 
Watch your step. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Sorry to drag you down into the bow. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. Pretty rough playing baseball out in all that snow. No, it, it wasn't in the winter, silly. I mean, we'd come up in the summer and we would have the best time. The whole family was there. Mom, Dad, my sisters. It was some serious competition out there on the big lawn. I don't know. Can't go back. New reality, right, Sam? Anyway. I'm supposed to be fixing this whole guy, right? Here, can you can you hold this? What's that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Nice one. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, sounds kinda complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. or some problem with the furnace. Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. Ah! Whoa! 
strangers. Hey. Uh, what? Hey. What the hell? Boom. You just got mucked. What? <laughs> nice. Nice one. That was good. What? But why would you do that? There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master. Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared. Admit it. I was not. Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh. What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. Hello, Earth to Matt. You gonna come with me to get my bag? Yeah. Yeah, I'm coming. Madam. Why, thank you, sir. Hey, ma'am. Yeah? I think we should start the weekend over. Right now. Clean slate. Oh? No arguing. No mic. No jazz. Just you and me. Enjoying ourselves and all this nature. Oh, you mean au natural? Damn straight. I can get with that. Doofus, come this way. You, uh, trying to get me somewhere private? Why don't you, uh, come find out? That's weird. Doing weirdo. What? I came back. Good boy. Now obey. Matt. Yeah? Thanks for helping me find my bag. I know I can be a little high maintenance. It's no problem, babe. But you gotta remember there's more to this guy than just being a lean, mean, luggage-lifting machine. You gonna back that up? All day. <laughs> what? All day. <laughs> Wait, what does that mean? Like, all day long. I was being, like, sexy. Cool. 
Oh, it's so pretty out here tonight. Wow. Yeah. It's so nice to be here with you, muscle man. Ah, uh, I'm not all muscle. <laughs> there are some brains in here too. Well, you got enough brains to like me, so let's see that bronze. You ever done it outside before? Outside of what? My car. I like your car. Roomy. This ain't roomy enough for you? Uh, you know what? Maybe there's a better spot. Does this spot start with a G? There are lots of places out here. I already started clearing this off for us. Like a gentleman. Oh, come on, let's look around. Oh, well, look at that. Hey. What the hell, Em? Don't be jealous. Why would you take me here? You made me feel like a chump. Don't be so sensitive. I'm here with you right now. Mike's the chump. Okay, maybe chump isn't the right word. What is? Lucky. Hmm. You got in there. What's so important in the bag, anyways? It's just my undies. The lacy ones. Well, why didn't you say we were scooping up such precious cargo? Andale, andale! <laughs> Whoa, Nelly didn't realize it was so important to you. Didn't, didn't uh, hello? <laughs> why do you think I'm even on this silly trip? Okay, well, now I know the secret to getting you to do what I want, when I want. Really noted. Not a secret, a true fact. Look at the sexy kisser on this thing. Dare to put your hand in it. Day, I wouldn't. Just slide it up in there. Ah! <gasps> You're ridiculous. Oh, come on. What was that? Uh, I'm not sure. Probably just an animal. Do not fight. You are, madam. Thank you. Oh my, very impressive. Me neither. Oh! Matt! What the hell's going on? What the hell did this? You know, I'm kind of not giving a shit about my panties anymore. I kind of just want to split. Agreed. Do you? 
you share this fear? Is that so? Because that's not reflected in the way you are playing your game. Now, is it? investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was most important in a person, loyalty or honesty? <laughs> so you would tell a lie in order to be loyal to a friend, okay. And what about loyalty versus charity? <laughs> so you would sooner look after your friends before caring for those in greater need? Oh, well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy of Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, and I'm thinking of them. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Boom. Butterfly effect. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me with your sluttiness? Stop it! Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Oh, watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Yes? <coughs> Jess? So, it says here, to communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. OK, then. Let's see what happens. Ashley, since... You're a recent convert. Why don't you be our medium for today? Okay. Um, is anyone there? Will you reveal yourself to us if you're there? <laughs> Wait a minute. Did you do that? I didn't do anything. It's moving again. <laughs> H? What's it spelling? Hold on. How's this happening? Are you moving it? I swear, it's just moving. Holy shit. Help? How are we supposed to help? I don't know. What does it mean? We need to know who it is if we're supposed to help them. Who are you? Oh, oh here it goes. OK, S. I. S. T. E. R. Sister. Sister? Whose sister? Oh, come on. Is this for real? Shut up. Ask it whose sister. Josh, it's, it's got to be. Yeah, OK. Well, which sister is it then? Ashley, ask who it is. Who are we speaking to? Hannah? Is that you? Oh, God. <laughs> this is messed up. Josh, are you? Fine. Are you sure? Because we can stop. No. Dude, it, it's cool. I want to hear what it says. I don't know where to start. Think about it. If this is actually Hannah, I mean, we 
can find out what happened that night. Josh? I can handle it. Okay. Um, let me think. Hannah, we miss you. And we want to know what happened to you. Can you, can you tell us what happened? B? E? T? R? Uh-oh. I don't like this. Betrayed. What does she mean? Oh, it, it's still going. Oh, God. K? I? L? L? E? D? No. Don't kill. We didn't kill them. It was just a prank. A Ash, calm, calm down, OK? Just we, we, we need to find out more. I'm sorry. I am guys, so guys, sorry. What, what do they mean? Ask them what, what happened. It's, it's, the, it's the only way to know. Ask them, Ash. Okay. Okay. How did you die? Hannah, what happened to you? L? I? B? The library. Maybe there's something in the library e here? E? R? O? O? Proof. There, there's, there's proof. In the library? Oh, no! Oh! <laughs> Holy shit. Chris? You know what? No, this is bullshit. This isn't real. Josh, I don't know what's going on. Listen, look, I don't know. I don't know if you think messing with me is somehow going to help me deal with my grief or whatever, but this is not cool. Josh, no. You wanted to use the spirit board. Hey, hey calm down. It's, it's not actually. I don't need this right now, OK? You guys are full of it. Should we go after him? Ah, oh, man, I, I mean, he'll be OK. Let's. Let's just give him some time. I don't blame him. That was crazy. The pointer flew right off the table. I mean, if, if you were faking it, if you were doing one hell of a job. I wasn't faking anything. I think we should do what it says. We should look in the library. Yes. Where did you go? This is not funny. Jess! Buddy, you in there? Ah! Whoa! Christ! I scared the blue out of my jeans. <laughs> what the hell is that doing in there anyway? Jessica, oh, come on. I totally promise I won't murder you when I... Oh! Oh, my, oh my God. God. No. <laughs> that was so good. Not, no. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. You have to see this. You have to I'm not see seeing it. No. No. no, no, no. <laughs> you recorded that? <laughs> Look at your face. I was scared, oh Jed. You can't just jump out at somebody. I'm in the middle of the woods. It's scary. I'm sorry to scare you. If we send that to anybody, I'm you know what? gonna kill you. I didn't know you had such a cute little lady like scream, Michael. <laughs> Guess you never really know someone until you've scared the pants off of them. As far as I can tell, my pants are still on. Oh, is that so? Yeah. Looks like you have to try harder. A challenge, eh? Well, I hope you're strapped in, because you're about to feel the full force of my mind-melting thrill skills.
Hang on, hook you up. Charming. It's everything you described, Michael. Wait, what? The cabin. I love it. Yeah. underestimate my culinary jobs. But hey, I'm gonna make this quick for you, okay? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, okay. Uh, geez, how do I? Uh, I can't watch this. Okay, 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 okay. Ah! 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 Mike, what, what did you do? What the fuck? It came. Ah! 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 Run! Run! Oh my god, what the hell? I don't know! Oh, there's a friend! Over here! Over here! Mike! Get over here! Mike, get the key, get it open! 
in! Oh, oh, oh my god! That was close. Uh, what? I don't under control. Whole time. Oh, bullshit! No, 100%. 100%. 110. Oh. Holy crap, I feel like I just ran a marathon. I think we kind of did. Was it a bear? Yeah, it's gotta be. Things are crazy fast. I mean, I didn't see it. Hey, things are not gonna come barging in, I promise. How can you be sure? Because I'm pretty sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. Really? Okay, well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real life. And I promise you that no bear or anything else is gonna open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay. I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. Huh. Typical. Brr. This is not the cozy chalet I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's a bit drafty or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Well, we don't need a fire to heat things up. Michael, I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. Mike. Yeah. Fire and mood lighting. Yes. My lady. Ah, this will take care of the mood lighting. All right, logs are ready to go. Just need a match. Nice. This will lighten up the mood a little. the lights. I know it's the lights, dummy. You broke them. But it's probably faulty wiring or something. You've got faulty wiring. Oh, hell yeah. These guys were inventive. What is gone? My freaking phone, Sherlock. You can't find it? Crap, no. I must have dropped it outside. Oh, shit. I can't lose my phone. My parents will kill me. You can always get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. Okay, okay. Well, I'll help you look for it. It's gotta be outside. Yeah, I don't think we want to go out there right now with the bear or whatever it is. Fine. I just wish you hadn't gotten me completely soaking wet trying to scare me. Kind of a dick move. I'm sorry, Jess. Probably fell out in the water and doesn't even work anymore anyway, so whatever. 
I'll make it up to you. I promise. Looky, looky. Who's gonna fire up some nookie? You've been dying to use that line since we got here, haven't you? Man one, fire zero. Very nice. Bravo. All right, my lady. What comes next? I think... Well, I, I wish we had some booze. Uh, well, uh, if I'd have known that ahead of time. I don't know, I'm kind of just, I'm not feeling it yet. Am I doing something wrong? No, 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 no. I mean, I thought you were one way, but you're kind of another way. Does if that make sense? It's, it's not your fault. Uh, Jess, I really like you. Whoever you think I am, well, just give me a chance, and I will show you what you need. Well, I am liking your confidence. Mike, the shutters. What about them? Um, close them, please? <laughs> There's just no one out there. I feel like someone's watching us. I don't like it. Yes, really. It's fine. <laughs> I really don't like it. Okay, shutter it is. Jess, look at this. Is it a fire? No, way cooler. Huh? How you like me now? Oh my god. Why do guns make men go completely bonkers? <sighs> Nothing. She'll never understand what we have together. Can you please close the shutters? Please? Looks like we weren't the only ones to meet the friendly neighborhood terror bears. That does not make me feel any better. Shutters are shut it. Now, where were we? I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. I think I'm a little freaked out, and it's hard for me to, like, keep this up, and... What? Keep, keep what up? Look, I act all super confident and like a total sexy babe and everything, but underneath, I gotta be honest, I'm really kind of insecure. You've got to be kidding me. What? You have nothing to be insecure about. Oh, <laughs> you have no idea. Sure I do. It's just like me and everyone else. We're all insecure. But you know how to handle yourself. You might call it a front, but it's real. Yeah, I guess I do. Yeah, and that's super fucking hot. Really? Yeah, hell yeah it is. Come here. Maybe I know how to handle you too. I am definitely ready to be handled.
It's your phone. What? How is it my phone? I don't know. It just came through the window. Oh, for fuck's sake, god damn it. What? Those goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us and just when we were getting down to business. <sighs> Hey! Yeah, pricks! That means you! I know! they were if I wish they weren't. I guess we should find out. really freaked out at the seance. Yeah, I mean, he, he looked like he was keeping it together, but... Do you think we shouldn't have mentioned his sisters? I mean, it's why we came back up here. Yeah, but not to, like, have a seance. Maybe we went too far. That's a good question. Should I push it? That's what buttons were for, I guess. Oh, that opens. That explodes. Are we, like, in a movie right now? If we are, I hope it's a rom-com. Leave it to the Washingtons to have secret passages in their house? I mean, maybe they didn't even know. This place is super old. So, should we take a look? Yeah, after you. No, 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 no. You go. <laughs> Gee, thanks. Whoa. What? Whoa, is what this... What did you find? Holy cow. Now, now Ash, I, I, I don't want to freak you out, but... But look at this. What? Chris, what is that? I... I think this might be what the spirit board wanted us to find. The clue? Yeah, it's a letter. Let me see it. It's a, a threat. Chris, this is serious. We need to find Josh right now. Do you 
think someone was actually after Hannah and Beth? If so, that would be really messed up. Looks like it was written by Josh's mom. Yeah, she's really making an effort to set things right with some native tribe or something. Yep, the bad karma goes back a long way. So, um, I've just been thinking about something I saw earlier with Sam. What? It, there was like this wanted poster, like full on Western style, you know? So? And Sam really thought there was someone following her around. So, so what you're saying, there's some criminal up on the mountain with us? There was a message on this answering machine I found and it, it, it was from this sergeant saying that there was this guy who had just gotten out of prison and that, there was nothing he could do. Well, what do you mean? He was saying it like, like a warning. I mean, maybe that's whoever was down in the basement before. What? Under the floorboards in the library, the light. Well, there was that guy I told you well, about. Wait, 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 what guy? The guy who threatened the Washingtons. I mean, he, he said he wanted to take revenge by burning the whole place down. And then I found that crazy psycho letter. Chris. If this is your way of trying to make me feel better, you're fired. You hear that? That was Josh! Coming from the kitchen. Josh! Josh! Coming! Hold on! Ashley! Ashley, what's going on? Let me in! Ashley! I'm gonna... Yes. I'm going to show you some uh, pictures of people that you have come to know. Like. But maybe you don't like them as much as you pretend to. Well, this is an exercise in honesty. Tell me which person from each pair you like the most. Take your time, your answers are important. Tell me, in this little game you're playing so diligently, who is it that you most dislike? Oh, but he's such a nice guy. 
I don't see what's not to like. Perhaps he intimidates you. He's big, strong, handsome. <laughs> well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. One individual we're considering as a person of interest. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. Apparently, he had warned them against pursuing their construction project in Blackwood Pines and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. S. I. S. T. Sister? Ask it whose sister? Josh, it's it's gotta be. Which sister is it then? Ah! Run! Oh. Oh. oh my god. Hush! Maybe I know how to handle you, too. Jessica! Ah! 
Ashley?
Oh shit. Ashley! Fred! Uh, Ash, I'm here! Where can I- God damn it! Please! Help me! Uh, I'm coming, Ash. Just, uh, just keep talking to me. What happened? Chris, please just me up. I can't move. Ashley, I'm gonna get you out of this- Thank you all for joining me. Tonight, we're going to conduct a little experiment, sort of test. Now for this experiment, we'll need the cooperation of our two test subjects, Joshua and Ashley. But we're going to need one more brave participant to help decide which subject will live and which will die. Please, 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 everyone calm down. It's all very simple. Christopher, you will find a lever placed directly in front of you. All you have to do is choose who you will save. Oh, no. Please, get me out of here. Oh, okay, 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 this is gonna be okay. Oh, dude, buddy. Oh Let's just think God. about this for Chris, a minute. You can't let me die. Just, just give me a second. I, 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 uh, huh? I can't think straight. Just, just. huh? Ashley, I'll get you out of this. I won't let you die. No. Thank you. Thank Please, you. No. This is insane. This is not going to happen. Please tell me this is not happening. I see. You've chosen to save Ashley. No, Chris! Oh, no, 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 Dad, don't, 
don't, don't, don't look at you. Why don't can't look. I look for sleep dummies, okay? Please. Oh. Ugh. I'm coming, Ash. I'm, I'm gonna get you. Ah. I'm running you down. Shh, shh, stop, please. Oh. Come on, come on. Let's, let's, let's get no. you down. Come on, we're gonna get you out of here. No! We gotta go, okay? <laughs> Josh, what, dude? You said Wait, not what? right in front of us, man. What are you there's, talking there's about? There's a maniac. Maniac? Oh my god, we gotta get out of here. I don't understand what there's happened. There's a maniac, what? and he was, there was a sign. It was either him or Ash, and I, I don't know what oh to god. do. Come right through, man, spilling out fucking everywhere. What? Oh my god, Chris, what? And I, I killed him. What, Chris? I, I, I killed him. It was my fault, man. No, no, this is insane. We need to go get some help. We go right in half. We're gonna figure this out. <laughs> Matt, we need to go get help now. <laughs> and we should look for the others. Mike and Jess are off 69ing each other, and who knows where Sam is. I think she's in the lodge. Fine. Fine, you're right. Get everyone else together, but if there's a maniac running around, I think we need to get some help, too, right? Not just wait around. But what about... Why are we still talking about this? Let's go! Poor people are getting what they deserve! I'm trying to help you. And this game you're playing, you understand that it's not good for you. It's not good for anyone. And I can't say that you're showing much loyalty in the way you're playing. our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. So have fun. Why would you do this? Jessica! Oh my god. Oh my god. Shit. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there?
Gee. That's not good. That's really not good. Wouldn't I end up in the creepiest place on planet Earth?
Oh. No one really wanted to take a peek inside. Twisted fuckers like the watch, I guess.
rest snooping around this paradise. just gets better and better.
There's a quaint little psycho crab. Stogie stash exposed.
It's locked. The hell who did that? Then there's some seriously uncool shit going on up here tonight. I can't believe Josh is dead. I can't believe how he died. No, I, I mean, what if they were wrong? What? Maybe we should have checked the shed to see if it was really true. I, I don't know. There are some things that once you see them, you can never unsee them. Yeah, I guess, but some things you have to see for yourself. I'll take their word for it. Paint? It's still fresh. I feel better with an axe. Oh, what now? This is locked, Matt. We'll break the door down, will ya? Whoa, wait a second. We start smashing shit down, he's gonna hear us. Well, you got any better suggestions? I don't know. What about... Look! What? The window. That's great, Matt. I can just about fit my lip balm through that little slot. No, come on. You will never fit through there, big guy. I won't fit, but you will. Are you nuts? You're gonna shove my ass through that little hole? I've seen you slip into some pretty tight jeans, Em. Uh, excuse me? It's a talent. Think again, lughead. No can do. For one thing, that maniac is probably just sitting there under that window waiting to blend us into pina coladas. Okay, fine. Here it goes. I'm gonna huff, and I'm gonna... Shh, just do it! got to Chris and Ash and Josh. He's got to know this is the only way back. Don't say that. <sighs> Look, the cable car's all the way out there. Well, that's, I, I mean, that's not far, right? You, you can jump it? <laughs> I'm good, Em. But not that good. Flattered, though. Well, Matt, if you can't jump that, what are we going to do? I, I don't know. God, everything is, like, so busted up. I think they knew exactly what they were doing. Someone really did a number on this joint. Such a mess. This place was barely in working condition before, and now? Hey, look. Fire tower. Hey, Magellan, maybe we should get the cable car working and take the show on the road, huh? Very friendly. <sighs> Unfollow. <sighs> Great. No keys, no cable car. So, back to square one. <gasps> what about the fire tower on, on the map you found? Well, I, I guess it's an option. Oh, maybe it has a radio or something. I mean, it, it would, wouldn't it? 
Probably, yeah. Matt, we gotta get to that radio! We can use the radio to call for help. But somebody's gotta pick up the signal. Oh, well, someone's learning to play by the rules. What? What rules? Rule number one, Emily is always right. Rule number two, nothing else matters because Emily is always right. Uh-huh. That's over. Yeah, for real. Climb down. Climb down what? The mount. Are you serious? What's the big deal? It, it's not like it's floating in the sky. <laughs> it might as well be. It's pitch black out. Hey, hopefully we won't have to. You think the psychopath is just gonna give up and run away? No. But maybe we should find a safe spot. Hold up, wait it out. It'll be a lot easier to figure this all out in the morning. As long as we don't hide in the lodge, that's where he expects us to go. step around here. Yes, Matt. Given the choice, I'd prefer not to spend my evening plummeting to my death off a snowy cliff top.
What are you doing out there? Being creepy. Okay. Trying to freak me out, guess what? You succeeded.
Now, that was exciting, wasn't it? Well done! The game seems to be going very well. Yes, all the good work. We did exploring the source of your fear. And you've just gone and used it for ill. Mm -hmm. Your overwhelming fear of the dark. You have turned it against these people who you so desperately want to torment. Has it been worth it? We gotta get out of here. I don't understand what happened. There's a maniac! This is insane. We need to go get some help. Hello? Guys? Hello, Samantha. Looking for me? We should look for the others. Mike and Jess are off 69ing each other, and who knows where Sam is. I think she's in the lodge. Why are we still talking about this? Let's go! Hey, look! Fire tower. What is that? I don't know. <gasps> Matt, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Stay calm. Relax. You're just deer. I just want to check us out as well. No, 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 Matt. They're gonna hurt us. If we do manage to get someone on the radio, we will. then we tell them we need help. What do we do while we wait? We go back to the lodge and get everyone else. Oh God, not the lodge. We should stay here in case whoever it is needs to get back in touch with us. Let's get that radio working first. Oh, that's freaking bright. No kidding. I can't see, what is that? It's just a security light. Motion sensor, probably.
Why is it so windy all of a sudden? We're almost inside. No power. <sighs> Sorry, Hannah. You're still missing. After tonight, their disappearance is starting to make more sense. Someone who's not a psychopath. Yeah. Blackwood Mountain by the ski lodge. There's a 
killer and he's after us and he's already killed one of our friends. Oh God, please help me. God help us. Something tricked the motion sensor. Probably a fucking deer. She wasn't up there? I don't know, I didn't see her. She must have come down here. I haven't seen her either. Oh! Did that just happen? Damn it, what is going on around here? Chris. Sam! What? Chris, I just want to say, what happened back there in the shed, I know how hard that was. Josh was your friend. Ashley, stop. No, I want to say, I mean, saving my life. Ash, what was I gonna do? Okay, I, I, I couldn't let anything happen to you. I couldn't. 
trash you are. Look at this. Chris, what happened here? I'm no forensics expert, but it looks like it was thrown. Did I see what? That, Chris, that! What that was that? It was like, it was like a see-through shape, like a ghost. Oh, boy. I'm serious. Why don't you believe me? I said I saw it. Doesn't that count for anything? We, we've been through hell tonight, okay? Your mind is fried. My mind is fried. I, I don't even trust what I've been seeing. No, you are wrong. I saw it, and I am sure, Chris. All right, all right. Maybe, maybe it's, maybe you did see something. Let's just, let's just keep our heads. Are we going crazy down here? It, it's, it's the only place left Sam could be, Ash. I wish we could just go find everyone else and- What if Sam needs us? What if she's in trouble? Oh, God. <laughs> let's go. See what? It's tiny furniture? No. It's a whole scene with dolls and everything. Yeah. Huh, I, I guess you need a key if you want to play around in there. How did everything get so freaky around here? Door slamming and candles lighting it out of Wait! Chris, 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 the ghost! What? Did you see it? No. You were looking at your phone, you dip. What are you tweeting? Hashtag, there's a freaking ghost after us. Ash, calm down, okay? There is no ghost here. The ghost of what? You're freaked out because of what happened with Josh. You're not and... paying attention. I saw it. I saw a ghost, and it looked like Hannah. It looked wait, like wait, Hannah. Wait, 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 what? Or maybe Beth. Jesus, Ash, what, what, what do you think? They followed us up here from the seance? I don't know, maybe. They didn't, because... Ghosts don't exist, okay? Oh, okay, who was talking to us at the seance, Chris? I don't know. <laughs> what did that? How does a picture just jump off the wall like that?
go. <gasps> oh my god! There! Look there, Chris! You can't tell me you can Whoa, see that! That's, uh, see? That's uh You do see it! I don't know. I I I I just <laughs> this is fucking crazy. Chris, it's showing us the way. wanted me to see this. What? What? Whoa, 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 whoa. What is going on here? Oh, God. It's, it's like... It's not like anything. That's us. <gasps> hiding there, waiting for Hannah. Last year. But it's, it's so accurate. I mean, that's exactly where I was sitting, and that's where Matt was. This was set up by someone. Who was there? Or someone, or something that was watching us. Maybe it's a warning. I think someone... I think someone put this here to mess with us. No, it has to be the ghost. It's trying to tell us the maniac killed Hannah and Beth. I think it's this bastard that he's, he's here trying to fuck with our heads. Why would he set this all up, Chris? He's trying to tell us that he's going to come after us all, too. <laughs> Dice! <laughs> Everyone being together here on the mountain is going to be so awesome. Cozy fires and hot tubs and OMG, Mike, I am so psyched to spend some time with him. I can't read this. It's so sad, Chris. That'd make sense, I guess. I don't like being watched. Better? Go suck an egg. Now it's better. Hey. Hey, look at this. It doesn't seem as old as some of the stuff down here. It's a catalog for industrial light bulbs. That is so random. Look. One of the bulbs is circled. Yeah, it's a powerful bulb. Huh. Just when you think it can't get any creepier. Oh! Jeez. I don't think I can take any more of this. 
Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm about at my limit here, too. All I wanted to do was forget last year ever happened and... To be honest, I'm not sure what Hannah thought she was doing. Yeah, well, you know how it is when you're crushing pretty hard on somebody. Great, so you're basically saying that we put a vulnerable friend in a terrible situation and essentially caused her to run away and never to be heard from again. If it was you, don't you think you would have run away? I mean, who likes being made fun of? <laughs> People don't make fun of me. To your face. What? Chris, we made her look so stupid in front of all of her friends and the guy she liked. I can't imagine doing anything worse to somebody. Bracelet, and she never takes this thing off. You gotta find her. Fast. Hey, these. Are these fake? Why would anyone make fake newspapers? <laughs> That's. freaked out too, but if Sam's down there all alone with a maniac and we leave, we're basically killing her ourselves. God damn it. Ashley, come on. Why are you always right? I'm not always right. Well, when you're right, you're right. I don't want to be. I want to leave. No. We've got to find Sam. Let's go. feeling from all of this. What do you mean? So we're saying that the same guy who made the newspapers also set up the camera, right? Yeah, I, I think so. It's just, it feels like he's constructing this whole story for us, then watching us run around, freaking out, seeing what we do, like it's like it's some sort of fucking experiment. Yikes, that, that's kind of, <laughs> yeah, that actually makes a weird sort of sense. Right? What is this, like a fucking hit list? Christ. Oh no, you've got to be kidding me. Repulsive! 
This can't be for you. Why the hell is I here? It's like a goddamn grindhouse movie in here. It's from last year. I think this is a little bit. Oh, come on. She Stupid prank. <laughs> uh, this is a little, this is a little uncomfortable, huh? She's here. I've she's never seen this video. She's just so. So what? Like, she's so excited. It's Hannah. And alive. Hey, Hannah. She has no idea. Oh, wait, wait. oh geez. Oh, wow. forgot you were such a willful oh participant. Matt, what are you doing here? This is horrible. Uh, Couldn't feel worse. Looks like you were enjoying yourself. That's the worst part, isn't it? We were just playing a joke. It was supposed to be funny. Yeah. I never want to see this video ever again. Oh. <sighs> Slow down, okay? I can't handle this ghost and these videos and everything just, just flying Just calm down. Around. Listen to me for a what? second. What? Calm down? Why should I calm down? Because I am freaking this out This has right got to be someone messing with us. What? Think about it. Ghosts don't hook up video cameras. They don't play games. Then who would set this all up? Seriously, I'm asking. I don't know. Maybe the same person who tied you up and killed Josh? Yeah, right. The same person who might have Sam right now. Maybe you're right. I wish I wasn't. That blood might be Sam's. All right, let me see if I can get this. Yeah, I got it, but oh, damn, this thing is heavy. Be careful. You gotta come through, Ash. I, I can't hold it. Yeah. Oh, come on. Chris. Wait, to what? I think I just saw Sam over there. Right, Ash, are you sure? I don't know, but come on, I think we should check it out. Yeah. Well, I'm pretty sure whoever's bleeding came through here, okay? So we really gotta get moving, like now. Ah! Wait, those are Sam. 
Yeah, that's those are Sam's clothes. That's just sick. I'd say that's just sick. So the psycho has been down here for sure. Do you think he's still down here? I hope not. Why is this thing even here? Million dollar question. She's not, she's not dead. How do you know? She's still breathing. What the hell is wrong? She's been knocked out. Oh, oh no, 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 this is bad, this is bad. We've got to get her out of here. Oh, oh shit! Ah! No, get back! Stay the hell away from me! off. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> this, is oh, this is the guy who killed Josh. God. No, God. You murdered a piece of shit. Oh, you monster. Look around. We're going to die, Chris. I don't think I'm ready to die. No one is going to die. I wish I could tell you. It's just not fair. <laughs> what? Tell me what? It's too late. Chris, what's the point? Stop it. Just say. We're always talking around it. And now, I mean, we've wasted everything. Ashley, none of it was wasted. What do you mean? Every second that I spent with you was the only thing I ever wanted to do with my time. <laughs> what are you saying, Chris? I'm sorry. I, I should have told you how I felt. Chris. Ashley, no. I swear when we get out of this... Oh, God! No. Ashley, I'll get you out of this! I won't let you die! Hello there, my special little subjects. So oh, shit. Scared, Chris. Don't be scared. Oh, you should be, Ash. Because here's the twist. Chris has made one fatal choice already today. And now, he must make another. Chris... You can take that gun in front of you and shoot Ashley, or you can shoot yourself. Whoever is left can live. The choice is yours. Oh. <laughs> Don't be so silly, Chris. choose to save you. If I do one last thing in my life, let me do this! Chris, please! Oh, oh God. No! Oh, oh God.
You have gone too far now. Don't you see? Huh? Don't you see that this torture porn has gone too far? Huh? Now what gives you the right to play God in these people's lives? What makes you so special then? Huh? You're sick! You're a sick fuck! Now what the hell have you done to them? Huh? What the hell have you done to them? Psychopath. Psychopath! I'm glad you found me. It's okay. Okay. You're okay? Where? Where's Jessica? She's she's not with you. Jessica's dead. What? He killed her, Sam. There's some maniac on the mountain who was trying to kill us, all of us, and I swear to God, when everyone is safe and accounted for, I am gonna hunt that fucker down and rip his nuts off. This guy who you're talking about, he attacked me. He showed me these videos too. And one of them showed Josh being killed, just ripped apart by this huge fucking saw blade. Jesus Christ, what the fuck is going on around here? There's a door here. It won't open. Can you unlock it from your side? What are you doing? Well, actually, the towel didn't turn out to be the best outfit for fighting off killer maniacs, you know? Do you mind, Mike? Oh, uh, right. My bad.
Okay, done. Let's put this thing to bed. I'm into that. What's that? Is that... crying? No! No, no, no! Get away! Oh, Chris. Oh, Chris, 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 Chris. What the fuck? You've heard of blanks before. I mean, really? be worth it. I look great in that top. All right. Now we're talking.
on. Busted elevator's my only way out.
on, for fuck's sake. Son of a bitch. Lovely. Danger is my middle fucking name.
Oh, she was down here. emotions that my sisters got to feel once one year ago only, only guess what they didn't get to laugh it off no 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 they're gone i don't know if you noticed this josh but none of us are laughing oh come 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 why the long faces come on it's good to get the heart racing every now and then right and race they did i mean every one of you just pitter pat pitter pat i hope you appreciated my little phantasmagorical spectacle I mean, <gasps> no detail too small that just no happened. opportunity missed it was such a delight to play the puppet master to to all of your pavlovian panic <laughs> and all that gore gore it was gore galore fake bodies i mean God, that shit was expensive. And no retakes. Nope, nope, nope. Only double takes. Oh, you should have seen your faces. Hook, line, and sinker for every little stinker. Josh, why are you doing this? Yeah, don't even ask this squirrely little runt. He's got no clue. He's out of his fucking tree. He's definitely off his meds. Oh, come on, you guys. Revenge is the best medicine. You're done. Mike, he's sick. What? Come on, you guys are all gonna thank me when you guys become internet sensations. Wait, what, what? Oh, you better believe this little puppy's going viral, ladies and germs. I mean, we got the unrequited love. We got, 
we got blood. I don't think there's enough hard drives in China to, to count all the views we're gonna get, you guys. What are you talking about, you asshat? Jessica's fucking dead. What? Did you hear me? Jessica is dead. You are gonna fucking pay, you ah! bitch! Ah! Guys! Guys, come on. Seriously, this is crazy, you know? Shut up. Why'd you hit her, man? Huh? Why'd you the fucking hit her? Ah! What are you talking you about? You punched Ashley, you piece of shit! I got so mad. You don't hit a girl. You, you just don't. Dude, dude, Chris, bro, I... And I'm not your bro. Where are we going? Where are you guys taking me? Locking you up, bro. What? You can't do anything stupid before we call the police in the morning. Come on. I didn't do anything. Are, are you serious, bro? Goddamn murderer is what you are. I didn't do it. Michael, please, just listen to me, man. I did not hurt Jessica. You know what, man? You need to shut up. Chris, hey, come on, coaches. We're partners. Stop. Don't say that. It's all fine. Be a dick. Can't take a joke. Oh, oh wait. Did I hurt you? Did you just you feel a little, a little bit of pain? Mm. Right now, I am so, so sorry. Ah, stop it! Jesus, stop! Oh, Michael, I'm sorry, man. I can't tell you how sorry I am that something happened to Jessica, but I swear, I swear to you, I have no idea what happened to her. Josh, be honest. You, do you really expect us to trust you for a single goddamn second after all the shit you put us through? <laughs> but can't we all just get along? <laughs> ah! Damn it! <clears throat> Not dicking around. Not how it's supposed to go down. <clears throat> You're just a bunch of bullies! You can't hang out a guy just to try like this, guys. Huh? Not like... Not like you got the guts to really do anything about it anyways. Ah! Ah! Really, really, really need to shut up, man. Oh. I, I mean, I, I, I don't even know what you mean because I, I don't have anything to regret. Oh my God. Okay, tie me up now, okay. Stay still, right, man. Right, 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 still. Okay. And tie him up if they just wiggle around. Gosh, dude. I leave me a little wiggle room, huh? What does it take to shut you up? Oh, not so tight, okay? Not so tight, okay? Okay, wiggle them around. Those plastic ties, that's where it's... In God's name, what is he talking about? This is hard to watch. You ever see this kind of shit before? Oh, I've never seen like this. Your money back. <laughs> Everybody's stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Chris and Ash. Chris is an ass. Ashley's a dumb dumb. <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry, what did you say? Well, I said you're a dummy, dummy. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Oh, Ashley. Oh. Ashley, I'll get you out of this. I want you to die. Oh, I never imagined in my wildest dreams that you liked me. Stop. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> You know what that sound is? It's the sound of never kissing Ashley, you pussy! Stop! Yeah, you know, 
You might as well let Ashley sleep with Mike. I mean, at least he's got some notches in his belt, you know? He'll treat her right! You fucking pathetic, Christopher! I'm gonna beat his head off! Don't listen to him! Not worth it! Hey, Mike! Mike, 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 Mike. Mike! What? What happened with Jess, Mike? You know what happened. No. No, I... I don't. I got a problem, Mike. I don't remember killing Jess. Jesus Christ. No, I mean, like, I feel like I, I would remember killing her, you know? She's a soft. And she's probably got, like, a really tight bod. Shut your fucking mouth! Seriously? What, what? Did you think I was gonna shoot him? I, I don't know. Come on, Chris. You know me better than that. Yeah, Chris. You know me better than that. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, just next time, give me a heads up, all right? Oh, oh, you poor little piggies. You can't even get your good cop, bad cop routine to work. Leave us to the pros, bros! Why don't you go back to the lodge? Make sure everything's all right. I'll stay here with this lunatic until the morning. Oh, sleep over. Can we order pizza? <laughs> you sure you're okay? Yeah. The one I know everything's fine back there. Yeah, you're right. See you in the morning. Josh! <laughs> <laughs> Josh! How does it feel? Do you enjoy all those emotions that my sisters got to feel once, one year ago? Only, only guess what? They didn't get to laugh it off. No! Nope! No, no, no! They're gone! Jessica's fucking dead! What? Did you hear me? Jessica is dead. And you were gonna fucking pay, you ah! dick! What happened with Jess, Mike? I don't remember killing Jess. She's Christ. Oh, God. Oh, my God, Matt.
is gonna be the way. Are you all right? I didn't think that I'd make it. You were screaming bloody murder. You, okay? you look totally wild. There was something. Where's Matt? Come sit down, sit down. Something's out there. Did you there. guys split up? A monster in the Wait. Monster? What are you talking about? I said there's something out like there. Like what? Ash, relax. It was Josh. It was all Josh. No, 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 no. Listen to we me. We got him tied up. He can't hurt you. No, it was after me and it wasn't human. Hold on. Wait, Em, where's Matt? Is he okay? I don't want to talk about that fucking sack of shit. Wow. He left me. He just fucking abandoned me when I was hanging off that goddamn tower about to die. What tower? And then I, I fell into this terrifying freaking mine shaft and he was just gone. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What, what mine shaft? I, I was walking down there in the mines and it was dark and I found this pile and there was Beth's head. Wait, what? Beth's head, I found oh it. Oh my god. What the fuck? Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. Listen, in in the tower, there was there was a radio, and, and I got through to someone, but then that was right when the tower collapsed. Em, you 
You made it. Oh god, yeah, yeah, Mike. Barely. <sighs> what about Matt? We're trying to figure that out. Yeah, and then there was this monster that was chasing her. I... She's all messed up, guys. Emily? Hey, Em? Whoa. Who the fuck can that be? Josh. Jess? It's not Jess. Sorry, man, but who is it? I don't know. We should check it out. I got your back. Good. Already, whoever it is, it's probably gone by now. I, I, unless you want me to take the gun. No, no, no. I think that's less good. You do the door, I got the gun. <laughs> Hold on there. Hold on there, mister. Freeze. Ah, what? All right, all right. Just take it easy, Grandpa. Okay, everybody, just calm down. Now, just move over there. Go on, move. Let me say what I came to say. I'm here to tell you what you're up against being back on this mountain. You should never have returned. I don't know why you did after what happened last year. You mean with Hannah and Beth? Yeah, how could you know without being involved? Oh, we're responsible. You hold on to your horses. I don't take kindly to you kids coming up here to my mountain. Your mountain? Huh? I'm sure the Washingtons would be very surprised to hear that. <laughs> well, the mountain don't belong to me, it's true. But it don't belong to the Washingtons. This mountain belongs to the Wendigo. <laughs> Who? What is he talking about? What the hell's a Wendigo? Let's hear him out. Not like we have a choice. Now, I'm only gonna tell you this once. It doesn't matter to me if you believe it or not. I got reasons I want to get it off my chest. See? I told you. He's guilty as shit. Guilty as something. Shut up, Mike. There is a curse that dwells in these mountains. Should any man or woman resort to cannibalism in these woods, the spirit of the Wendigo shall be unleashed. Oh, crap. <laughs> find somewhere safe. The basement might be okay. Okay, get down there now, all of you, and wait. What? Why? For how long? Until dawn. Guys, I ran off and left Josh when I heard screaming. Where did you leave him? In the shed. Uh, your friend will already be dead. No. No, he can't be. We, we were just with him. A lot can happen quickly on this mountain. No. I'm gonna go get him. You can't go out there, Chris. I'm supposed to be his best friend, and, and, and I let him down. No, he let you down, Chris. He let all of us down. I don't care. I'm going to get him. Then I'll go with you. I, I don't need your help. You going alone is suicide. Fine. The rest of you, get down to the basement. Be safe. Don't go outside again until we're back. You don't seem to understand the magnitude of the situation. Well, I'm going to get Josh, aren't I? No, I'm going to get Josh. You're going to help me. Do you understand? Uh, yeah, I think so. You need to follow me and do everything I tell you. Shotgun, man. No, you don't. What? How do you know? Trust me, I know. Hey, come back safe. Come on. We need to hurry, son. I, uh, I'll see you soon. It's a 
So, so, so tell me, you're the expert on these things. What's uh, what, what, what's a guy got to know? You just be careful. You follow my lead. So, how many times do I have to shoot it with the shotgun before it's dead? Well, you've been shooting it a long time. You, you mean this thing won't even kill it? No, it'll slow it down. Well, how do you kill it? They don't like fire. I don't like fire. They fear it. And it can kill them, if you have to. See, their skin is like... It's like tough armor. Unless you burn it off first. It's gross. Well, what are these things like? I mean, are they just crazy unpredictable, or... I mean, can you figure out what they're gonna do? Well, they adhere to some pattern. Like any animal. Or human. You mean, like how? Have you got schedules? Well, they only hunt at night. Oh. Why? I didn't ask. Wendigo tips? Like if I rub garlic all over me, they won't be able to smell me or something? They'll still smell you. Anything like that? I can't see you if you're standing still. It's like toes. <laughs> Sight is based on changing the movement they're feeling. So if I don't move, I, I, I'm basically invisible. Yeah. Well, I wouldn't recommend testing it out. Unless you have no other choice. Damn it! Damn it, what happened? Oh, he's gone. We're too late. Shh. We gotta go. Right now. We gotta find Josh. He can still be out there. <laughs> First, the wind you go. He'll render you a mobile. And then he strips the skin off of your entire body, piece by piece. And he keeps you alive and aware and feasts on your organs, one piece at a time. So the launch then. Yeah. Let's go now. It might still be near. Forget it. Yes! <laughs> 
Ashley. Oh, thank God, please. Let, let, let me in quick. Oh, my God. Chris! Oh, my God, what happened? We gotta, we gotta go. That thing was, like, right behind me. Ah! Go, 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 go! so good up there right now. Understatement of the night. Chris, where's the flamethrower guy? Uh, yeah, he, uh... He didn't make it? No. What happened? The thing, it uh, tore him apart. Right in front of me. Oh, God. All right. These are all the doors? Yeah. Are you sure? What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, look, I really don't think that's a good idea. We should stay put right here until dawn. At least we're safe down here. Oh, yeah? All wrapped up like a little present with a bow on top for that thing to tear us apart on Christmas morning? People will come for us in the morning. You don't sound so sure. That is what'll happen, right, Em? Yeah, I, I mean, right? Well, you can wait. I'm leaving. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's gotta have it. Josh? One of his dirty little tricks. Great, great. If that fucking thing got a hold of Josh, then we're shit out of luck. I don't know, Mike. It's possible. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? I saw some horrible stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and... Huh. Em? What? Fuck it. I'm gonna get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. And what is all that? It's uh, that old guy's bag. Is that a map? <gasps> that guy was prepared for anything. <laughs> Not quite. What is this place? Oh, my God. Wait, wait, wait. What is that? I was down there. It was horrible. You were? You have been a cave-in in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. Oh, my God. Some of them survived, but, like, 15 of them didn't make it. There was this reporter, and I think he figured out there had been some, like, big cover-up going on. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. And I'm not sure what it means, but I found this chair. Dried blood all over the place, like somebody'd been tortured. Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how we're gonna get the fuck out of here, please. I'm just saying, it's weird how much crazy shit's gone on up here. What's weird is that there's a tunnel leading from the lodge to the sanatorium, see? That's how I got back here. I saw this when I was down there. That's where it lives. Em? Em, what is that? Huh? What is that? Ash. Em, oh my god, oh my god, it's, oh it's my nothing. god. It's oh nothing. No. It just oh no, it, it bit no. me and... It bit you? What bit you? The... the Wendigo. What? It's nothing, really. It's not a big deal. You okay? Shit. It doesn't hurt anymore, really. It's it's not that bad. Em, if that thing bit you... I, I know what you're thinking, and I'm fine. Are you? Yes. Emily, at least let us check it out. Emily, if the Wendigo bit you, you could turn into one of those things. Oh, that's ridiculous. He said it was from eating each other. Remember, he said oh, that. Is that how it worked? Yes. It happens if it bit you, you're gonna turn into one, and then you're gonna turn on us. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! You can't be down here with us. What? Mike! You gotta go. Are you kidding me? You're putting us all in danger. Like hell I am! Emily, you can't stay here. <laughs> Mike, just cool your head, okay? We don't know if it works like that. Maybe it's just a bite. I've seen what these fuckers can do, and I don't want to say it again. What is this? Guys, what are you doing? Door's right here. I am letting you do this voluntarily. Oh no, you're just making yourself feel better about sending me to my death since you know there's a Wendigo out there ready to rip me to pieces like it did with... Okay, oh my god, will you just go? Go, get out of here! Whoa, okay. Whoa, 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 Mike, calm down. You're... you're gonna shoot me? <laughs> Like me? 
This is the safe room, M. Please. It is not safe as long as you're in it. Don't. Not for us. Don't, don't do that. I'm really sorry. right thing. I hope you did. Maybe. For now. <sighs> Shit. Fuck, fuck. Keep an eye on her. If you see anything weird, you guys know what to do. Yeah. No one leave. Okay? It's not safe out there. I'll be back soon. I thought that, that he was gonna help us. With a flamethrower, dude? Now we don't have a chance. No, guys, it just means we've gotta be tough. We've gotta do this on our own. I don't know if I can. What does it say? It says that the bites, it, if it bites you, it's not infectious. It doesn't do anything. Let me see uh, that. I'm sorry, what did you say? Um. So she'll be okay. It says what? You're gonna be fine. Fine? Michael almost shot me, is that she fine? She didn't shoot you. And this bitch almost let him. Hey, that's not fair, she was scared. I'm the one who's scared. I, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Emily. I didn't know what was going to happen. There's none of us know. There's no excuse, there's no excuse please, Emily, it. please, just try to understand. Understand the palm of my hand, bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so, 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 so sorry. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. We've got to get to Mike. Like, now. Oh, Joshua. You should have listened to me. Because of your choices, people have died. I don't know which is worse, actively triggering events that lead to someone's death, or passively allowing a tragedy to occur. Because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger to help someone else. Remember last year, huh? How you left your poor sisters to die? You did nothing to help. Paralyzed by your own self-centered fear. While a real threat was closing in. No, it's all about you, Josh. It's always all about you. Your game has gone terribly wrong. And your friends, like your sisters, have deserted you. You're all alone. Can you feel how cold your loneliness has become, huh? Why did you hurt them? Joshua, why did you hurt them? Well, they didn't hurt you, Joshua. Not intentionally. They made a stupid mistake and a terrible tragedy befell your sisters did not intend for that to happen. It just did. And they were sorry, at least, until you subjected them to your night of horrific torture.
just a game? But it's a game that has driven you to one of your own deepest fears, Joshua. Darkness. It's not so good up there right now. Uh, he's gone. We're too late. Shh, quiet. Uh, yeah, he, uh... Wait! Don't move. Holy shit! What the... What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's gotta have it. And what is all that? It may have taken him down to the mine. I was down there. It's horrible. There had been a cave in, in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. Em, um, what is that? Huh? This is the safe room, Em! Please. Fuck, I can't do this. Oh, you did the right thing. Keep an eye on her. I'll be back soon. I just need a pitchfork and a mob.
Hey, big guy. Happy to see me again, huh? Hey. Just hoping I'd run into you again. All right, pal. Come with me. All right. Here's the plan. I happen to see a map of this place, so we're not flying blind. There should be a way through the psychiatric wing that'll take us right outside the mine. Think you can handle that? Couldn't have said it better myself. Ah, what? I can move like you, Wolfie. Stuck on this side. All right. There goes nothing. Doors were built like tanks. How crazy were these inmates? What went on here? This is nuts.
Time, boys. It's enough for me for all ya! Okay. 
Catch you on the flip side, huh? I'm kind of giving out here, guys. Uh, I think maybe you should go on without me. No, Chris, we're not leaving you. We're sticking together. Mike will just have to wait.
Like must have locked behind him. Crap! There's gotta be another way in. Wait, hey, what about this? I mean, should, should we try it? Well, it's not like we got a whole lot of choices here. Okay, this is maybe the last place I would want to be right now. So who's going first? <laughs> After you. It's not so bad. You think this is the tunnel to the sanatorium? Of course it is. Where else would it go? Chris, I know you're hurt, but you gotta move it, all right? I'm trying, Ash. Mm. We should close this, right? Huh? I mean, what if something's following us? Yes, fine, close it. But we gotta keep moving. Can you just catch up, please? Yeah. there? Anybody? Jessica! Is it you? This is fucking crazy. Jessica. Ugh! Jessica, is that you? I am so glad to see you. Glad you're safe. Look. Look there. Wow, great. <sighs> the ladder's toast. We're never gonna make it up there. No, 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 I think I can. I think I can do it. It's like a rock wall. I'm gonna keep going. You should head back to the lodge. I've gotta get Mike. Good luck.
Hello?
any marshmallows? down to where this fucker lives. Emily! Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's gotta have it. Oh, he's gone. We're too late. Shh, quiet. It may have taken him down to the mine. Wait. I'm gonna get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. That's it. That's it. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Run! Let's find a way down to where this fucker lives. imagination of a self-indulgent, spoiled little brat! You had so many people who cared about you, who were willing to help! But at every turn, you choose to push them away, and now you're all alone. Though by the sounds of things, it won't be long for long. No, you won't be alone for long. Deep breaths, Josh.
So what? What does that mean? So Hannah must have buried her. God damn it. God damn it. Hannah was down here. I don't believe any of this! She would have been starving. She would have been desperate. Fuck! We need to find Josh. Right now.
Tripping or something. Josh! M Mike. Josh! Hey, man. Don't, don't hit me, please. please. Well, you were deep in it, man. Full mental jacket. We didn't think we'd get you back. Josh, Hannah was down here for weeks, a month. She dug Beth up. Sam. Mike. Hey, let's just get the fuck out of here. Okay. Josh, do you have the key for the cable car? Uh, yeah. See that over there? That means there's a direct way out. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> there's no way Josh is gonna make it up there. Okay. If you help me up, I can go back to tell the others we're okay. Yeah. Yeah. Good. You bring Josh back the way we came, and we'll all meet at the lodge. Be careful. Yeah, you too. <sighs> all right, let's go. You fucked up son of a bitch. Uh, yeah, um, I'm sorry about before, man. I, I thought you killed Jess. I was wrong.
How the fuck are you still alive? Yeah. There's something been going on tonight. Someone really fucking with us up here. No. What? It's not someone, it's something. Jess, you, you, you had a pretty rough night. I, it's pretty confusing. No. I'm telling you. It's okay. I, I, I didn't mean to scare you. No, oh, God. Can you move? Yeah. Come on, Jess.
It's gonna look worse if we stay out here. Come on. How do you rate our chances of survival? Hmm? I'm trying not to think about it. Go, go, go!
structure is completely destroyed. Over. saved my life and I watched him die I heard Jessica I don't know how or why she was down there but I know I heard her he held it right up to my face right here right in front of my nose and he could have shot me he almost shot me the prick I mean you go out with a guy for however long and you think you know him but man this one really takes the cake I was right there, and I could have done something. I tried to do something. It wasn't good enough. How did you end up in the mines? I was carried and um, taken and... What did you see? I don't know. I don't, I don't know. He's out of his fucking mind. He wanted to hurt us. Okay? And... I thought he was the one who attacked Jess. I thought we were close. After his sisters disappeared, he'd come and talk to me. He said I was the only one who understood him. I thought... I thought we had a connection. If you need someone to talk to... I'm fine. Sometimes, after a traumatic experience... I said I'm fine. I... I stabbed him, and I tried to get away, but I didn't know. I swear I didn't know. Didn't know? Who did you stab? Oh, I, I, I stabbed the maniac. I didn't know it was Josh, but then he was the psycho. And how was I supposed to know Josh had all the sauce and the gun and oh my god. You bringing in Meat Brain next? Gonna kick him around a bit for me? I'm sorry? Meat Brain, Mr. Muscle Brawn, Matt the Incredible Sulk. Is there something we need to know? Oh, no, nothing important except, um, you know, how he basically left me to die up on a freaking tumbling tower like a world-class douche nozzle? Your friend Ashley, she told us she tried to help you. <sighs> She said she heard you calling out. <sighs> Not me. Mike. What do you remember? He came for me. He did. Came for you? Where is he? Did he make it? You need to listen to me. I don't care if you believe me or not. It doesn't matter because you will. You need to go down to the mines. What's in the mines, Sam? I've seen what's down there. And I'd give anything to unsee it. Survivor. Is that? Oh, fuck. Stay back! Stay back! No, no! Stay back! 